guys, what's up? What it do? Welcome back. Hope you're having a great week and thank you for coming back for another video. Today I'm gonna do a vlog. That's pretty much all I've been getting requested for on my last few makeup videos. So many of you just want more vlogs, which I'm totally fine with. And today I'm actually going down to San Diego to film a collab and to meet up with one of my good friends for lunch. So I think it would be like a fun day to vlog. I'm about to head down there in a few minutes. Actually just waiting for my mom to bring me something. So I figured I would kind of start the vlog in the car. Um, but yeah, this is gonna be one of my flashbacks vlogs. I wanted to show you guys all the upgrades I'm doing in in my beauty room right now. I recently was talking on Snapchat about wanting to just upgrade my video quality for you guys and have the best like background. So I ordered a new vanity on Black Friday and tons of other decorations for that room from like home goods and a bunch of little Christmas trees. So I set most of it up last night. It's like almost done. So after we go down to San Diego today, um, I'm gonna show you guys tonight like that whole room everything I've redecorated in there and kind of get your opinion on what you would like to see in the background and stuff like that So yeah this morning, um, I've already ran a few errands I went to drop off some Poshmark orders So if you purchased anything from my Poshmark, it is on the way while I dropped those off at the post office I picked up a few packages So I wanted to do a little like unboxing with you guys because I have to wait here anyways I think my mom's gonna be here in like 20 minutes um, So they had a few stuff for me there I also got some letters from you guys and I wanted to say thank you so incredibly much so the P.O. Box actually doesn't call me every time I receive a letter. So if you sent me a letter and you're wondering why I didn't respond right away, or if you left like your Instagram on there and you were waiting for a message from me, I only go like once a month. They'll only call me if I get like a big package or something and they need me to go so that they can like get it out of their space. But I read probably like eight to 10 letters from you guys that I picked up and that means more than anything. So if you've taken any time to write me at my P.O. Box, please know I'm extremely grateful. Um, I also picked up, uh, like I said, two to three packages that I'll show you. The first one is from Pinch. I've heard a bunch of my YouTube friends talk about this but I have never received their box it is a subscription that's free and I was like what but for you guys what's really cool is you go on their website you make an account and you put in your email you don't they don't require a credit card or anything like their entire service and brand is free like how cool is that so basically you just get a box with tons of samples so it looks like the one that they got for me looks like this like jam-packed actually watched um, another girl's video on this last night because they said they were sending it over and they laid out that it was free and everything and I was like what are you talking about like I was like super into it because most subscription boxes obviously will be anywhere from like 10 to 30 bucks a month so I thought it was really cool that they offer something not just for youtubers for you guys watching literally anyone can sign up I will have their website down below um, but they have a bunch of just like little snack items in there and what is this Pantene gold series infused with argan oil repair mask. Okay. This looks like full size That's crazy for no cost like that's insane I know they also have like a points and like a perks program on their site So if you sign up to be a member, um, there's like little activities you can do on the site each month to earn more points And you can get like bigger boxes and more full-size items. We have some Zquil in there tons of little snacks in here um, we have some RX bars. My friend Yami talks about these all the time. They look really good, actually. I've never, I believe they sell these at Whole Foods, but I have never uh, purchased these myself. So I'm actually excited to eat these. I didn't eat anything right now. It's almost one o'clock and I'm heading down to San Diego. I haven't like eaten anything. So I'll probably have one of those right now for a snack. So there's also a Shea Moisture Sensitive Hand and Body Lotion. Super good size for travel. Like this will take you a long time to go through. And I know they sell this brand at Target because I recognize that. What the? Oh my gosh, they also included a full-size Pantene Gold Series Conditioner. This has got to be like at least a $10 value right there just for this one product. So it looks like there's just some Orbit gum and a few other snack products in there, but overall, huge box and a huge value for literally giving that to the customer at nothing. I think that's crazy. Um, I will have their website listed down below if you guys want to sign up for that, especially during the holiday time if you're tight on money and you want to get a box for yourself or for a friend. I think that's so awesome that they do that at no cost. So big thank you to them for sending one over for me. This is the first time I've ever got anything from Pinch, so I appreciate you guys including me and my audience. So the second package I had there was just my scale. Um, I mentioned this before. It's the body analyzer. I've used it, showed you guys it in a bunch of like weight loss videos and stuff. It measures your body fat, um, water retention, your body weight like to a T. It's the best like at home scale you can have. That's the most accurate. I've been using it, I want to say like two years, but it actually broke. Christian um, got water in the last one. So when I moved into this new place, I haven't had a scale because I've been wanting to order another one of those. So I just picked that up. Um, that was pretty much it for the post office. So I think I'm going to run through Starbucks really quickly and wait for my mom to get here. Then we will head down to San Diego. But yeah, then we'll be back this afternoon to check out my beauty room and all the upgrades. And I'll show you guys kind of how I am transforming everything in there because I'm really 
like really really very happy with all the updates that I've made and I purchased like a bunch of decor on Black Friday that I've pretty much almost all set up and I really think you guys are gonna like it so so I always get questions on Instagram about my drink choice it varies but today I went with a grande caramel macchiato upside down I always ask for light ice and I ask for almond milk to make it vegan so it's super super good pretty low calorie and it gives me a ton of energy Tofu, maybe I'll just do that. Okay, how I'm gonna do avocado, crab, sweet onion, and cucumber, please. You want the same? Um, no crab. I'll just okay. do the avocado. Alright, guys, so we came to get pokey. This is Leah. Say hi. Um, so I got it for the first time. I got tofu in here. Usually most people go with salmon. I'm sure you guys are familiar. I'm probably the last person on earth to try this, but it looks super healthy. It's like very low carb and macro friendly. Do you want to share what you got in yours? Oh my gosh, what is that? <laughs> it's a bowl with spring mix, salmon, edamame, cilantro, jalapeno. Oh my gosh, it's so good. My looks favorite. Amazing. One, two, three. Hey guys! Good morning! So it is now the next morning. Um, It's almost noon. Last night I didn't get home until almost midnight. Getting yeah, home from yeah, San Diego. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To pick up this little nugget. How cute does he look today, by the way? He's stunning, baby. You want to turn around? So cute. So yeah, we just got done at the gym. It's almost noon. Christian is going to nap here in a minute, and I'm going to show you guys everything with my beauty room. I know I said at the beginning of the vlog, I wanted to show you all the upgrades. I want to go into the new camera I got and show you guys the backdrops I bought versus like the decor to see what kind of background you want to see. I got that new vanity mirror and just a bunch of other stuff. So I'm going to put him down for a little nap, and then we'll get into all the details of that room. All right, so I'm gonna throw up a picture on the screen right now of what this room used to look like when I very first moved in and I decided it was gonna be my beauty room. I just had very, very minimal decor. So this is what we're working with now. Again, I'm just kind of doing what I could do in this space. It's a bummer that that window is positioned there because the lighting is usually off and the room you know, it's not perfect or anything, but this is kind of just what I've come up with and how I've decided to decorate. I've changed up a lot of things, so I wanted to go over with you guys where I purchased everything and kind of how I effectively store everything with really affordable storage solutions. So ignore this. I'm just trying to give you guys the brightest version that I can today possible. So if you missed my other video about the vanity, I'll just go over everything. It's from Ikea. It's called the Linman. The chair is from Marshalls. I really love this chair. I think it was like 115 which is a pretty good deal if you're gonna keep it for years and you keep it clean, and it's very comfy. Um, the rug here is from Walmart. I think it was literally like 10 bucks. So we'll just start here and go all the way over. All the pictures are either just from Home Goods or Target. The marble wallpaper was from Lowe's. I will link that below. Check the description box because I am gonna link my new vanity and all my storage and just pretty much everything for you guys. So over here, this is still just travel makeup that I've gotta go through. I went through my collection. I wanted to put a lot of stuff away for a giveaway for you guys. So all this I'm giving away. This entire thing I will be giving away in the month of December on Instagram. So just be sure that you're also following me over there. So moving along here, I ordered two more of these makeup, um, acrylic makeup storage, which I have over here and you guys have seen before. These have been really efficient for me. They're pretty affordable. Um, I used to order some like two years ago. I ordered a few from Muji and I believe they were... I don't know, like 60 bucks each, and I was able to find these ones on Amazon for 43 or something. So I still have to put more stuff down there, and I just kind of put my palettes on here for now. These are for like a holiday gift guide, but um, this entire side of my vanity used to be blank. So I'll step back and kind of give you guys a full overview here. So I have the two there, the two there. I also just down in here ended up just putting um, like lash glue and like basic stuff that I need in here, and then just more storage for additional palettes. And then these drawers are just mostly like wigs and extra makeup. 
So then the main thing that I ended up getting on Black Friday was a new vanity mirror. I've seen so many of my friends have one of these from Impressions. Um, I did purchase this. I'm not like affiliated with them or anything. I'm sure I could have emailed them and seen if they wanted to work with me and like got a discount or whatever, but it was a pretty good deal on Black Friday and I was just so anxious to get it. So this is the one I chose. There's about six or seven different models on the site. So this one, it has a dimmer and the lights are actually, they come off iridescent, kind of like yellow as you can see, but you can make it, you know, as dim or as bright as you prefer. So you just have your little switch like that. And then on this side, it does have two plugs. So you can plug in like your straightener or your curler, which I prefer. So I think it just gives the whole desk and the vanity overview like a more chic vibe. And I think when I film in this room for you guys to see this in the background, you're really going to like that. I got a lot of feedback on my last video that you didn't like the backdrop and you just wanted to see like all of this. So now that this desk is almost pretty much done, I'm still going to put like more makeup in those bottom drawers. But I think this would be a really cool background for you guys to see in the videos. So that was the main thing I got on Friday. I'll link this down below if you are in need of a good vanity mirror. I know that they come with a warranty. And they are an investment, but again, if you take care of it and you can have it for years, I think it just looks really classy and pretty. So yeah, super happy with that purchase. Everything over here is pretty much the same. If you've seen my beauty room, this is all like really nothing new. I did get this little palette holder from, where did I get this? Um, Joann's, I believe. So I just have some cute palettes just kind of chilling in there. Normal flowers. Then over here, I did kind of switch this up. Some of these cubbies were blank before because I just didn't have any boxes that I really liked. So these two I got at Joann's, those pink ones. I believe these other ones are from Home Goods. Again, I just wanted something like super colorful. So when you do see this behind me in my videos, it's like visually pleasing to you guys and it's kind of a really fun, like cheek girly vibe that you guys get to see in the video. So I thought that would be more interesting than a backdrop. This thing again, um, this cubby holder is from Ikea. I can link this below for you, but just picked up a bunch of like pink and flowery little cubby holders. I thought that was really cute. All the Christmas trees are from either Home Goods or Marshalls. This one is my favorite. It's like so sparkly in person. It's really cute. This, I cannot remember. Damn, where did I get this? I always shop at the same places, so it's gotta be like Ross or Marshalls. I think it was only probably like $10 but I just wanted to do like a little Christmassy vibe on top of here. I also got these iridescent circle lights. I'm actually, I haven't got batteries for it yet because I thought they came with batteries, but they don't. So I need to just get some triple A's for that. I have a few of these around the room as well. I believe these are just from Charming Charlie. Then nothing new really over here. I just have my normal perfumes and candle, which you guys have seen. My Bellamy box for one of my wigs. I just thought that was like a cute box and went with my theme. So I just put it over there. So stepping back here, this is kind of just the overview of that side of the room. Again, I think I want to switch this picture and put it horizontally right here. Have yet to do that. Also then, just moving over here, I wanted to share with you guys, I shared that I did finally upgrade my camera, which I had been wanting to do for so long, but honestly, it's a huge investment. I'm very transparent with you guys that I'm also on a budget like you, and I definitely need to save up for something when it's a big purchase. So I believe this was like $350 or $400 off on Black Friday. So I ended up getting the 80D. It was from Best Buy. I did get cash back with Ebates, which was super cool. I've done tons of research on what would be the absolute best quality camera for video for you guys. And the only thing that was higher than this was the Canon Mark IV, I believe, or Mark III, but that was like a $3,000 camera. And I'm just not ready to do that yet. So this is what I chose. Um, really enjoying it so far. I definitely have to mess with the settings, but if you also make videos and you want something high quality, I would highly recommend. Definitely try to get it when it's on sale. So I did pick up a few backdrops because I do want to have like the beauty background in my vanity room, but I want to do backdrops sometimes. So let me try and up my lighting here. I want you guys to be able to see the material on this one. So you could just get like paper backdrops, which are super cheap, but I chose to get fabric. So I actually went to Joann's and went to the like fabric section where you can make your own curtains. And I chose like really high quality like pieces. So like this was like $30 a yard, which is crazy. So I really hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I just wanted something that would look so much better for you. I think if I do a get ready with me or a makeup tutorial, I'm going to use this. This actually feels kind of like let like fake leather, I think. And then it's just got kind of that rose embroidery on there. I thought that was really pretty. This one is just taupe and we have tons of different studs. And then I have that red one, which I used in my very last video. So I picked up three backdrops. Um, what I think I'm going to do is end up selling this little bench because I don't even sit here. Like I, I don't even really use this. 
So if I sell this and I get this out of the way, that's gonna free up this entire wall. Then I think I'll set up a backdrop setup on this wall. So when I do like chit chats and tea times, I can film kind of right here and give you guys this whole pretty like beauty setup. But when I wanna use the backdrop, this entire wall will be free. So I'll set up like my backdrop, my backdrop stand right here and I can hang up like whichever one I wanna use for the day and have this whole wall. Because this little like love seat thing is super cute, but it's not functional in this room. I really don't use it much. So I need to move that and go ahead and do that. But yeah, this is kind of just the overview of everything that I've been working on probably like the past week. Let me, come on. I'm trying to use manual exposure right now to give you guys the best view. I turned down the brightness a bit. But yeah, I'm super happy with how this is coming along. It's taken me a while. I've been in this apartment almost five months and this is just barely like almost fully done. I'm super, super happy with it. I hope you guys do enjoy and this will just be like a good background for you that you'll enjoy watching in my videos. So I wanted to show you guys pretty much all the updates that I did and where I purchased everything. So yeah, that's gonna do it for this vlog, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I love and appreciate you so very much. I'm so grateful for all of your support this whole year and I just, you know, feel like I wanna make it so much more known during Thanksgiving and when I think about the end of the year, what I'm so grateful for. You guys are right there top of the list with my family. So, hope you guys are having an incredible week. Um, I have a few more holiday gift guide videos. I'm gonna try and get out as quick as possible so you can still like utilize those before you finish all your Christmas shopping. Be sure to follow me on Snapchat and Instagram because I'm doing three makeup giveaways in December and I wanna make sure you all get a chance for that. Um, so yeah, please subscribe to my channel. I will have a new video, what's today? What day? Oh, why did it just get so bright? Uh -huh. Okay, that's better. Um, I believe I will have a new video tomorrow, so please just be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Love you, like I said, and I'll see y'all tomorrow.